What is the value of the expression 8 minus 6 divided by 2 then times 3? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? This expression has tricked almost 95% of people. Let's break it down and solve it together. To solve this question, most people first go for the subtraction between 8 and 6 and write this expression as 2 divided by 2 then times 3. In the next step, they usually perform the division between the 2's and simplifying this expression to 1 multiplied by 3 which finally gives them the answer 3. And immediately, they say that the correct answer to this question is option B. However, this answer is actually incorrect. Also, some other people to solve this question first go for the multiplication between 2 and 3 because they think multiplication has a higher priority than division. So, they rewrite this expression as 8 minus 6 divided by 6. And the next step, they perform the division between the two 6's since they believe division has a higher priority than subtraction. And they simplify this expression to 8 minus 1, which finally gives them the answer 7. Then, without any hesitation, they quickly say that option C is the correct answer to this question. But, I have to say, we were tricked and it's not the correct answer to this question. Alright, now let's go step by step together and I will show you how to solve this expression properly. To solve this problem, we must follow a rule that is called PEMDAS. And this rule, P stands for parenthesis, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. We should perform these operations exactly in order from top to bottom. Okay, according to the PEMDAS rule, we must start with the division and multiplication because these two operations have a higher priority than subtraction. However, it's very important to keep in mind that multiplication and division have exactly the same level of priority. In this situation, the best approach is to start from the left and perform these two operations in order. So, first we perform the division between 6 and 2. And instead of the original expression, we can write 8 minus 3 then times 3. In the next step, we should perform the multiplication between the 3's because multiplication has a higher priority than subtraction. So, this expression simplifies to 8 minus 9. And finally, we get the answer negative 1. Therefore, option A is the correct answer to this question.